Hey everyone and welcome to Learn DaVinci Resolve. Today's quick weekend shorty is going to be on how to output individual clips if you're uploading for stock footage. So stay right there. Okay, some of you have asked about doing stock footage and how to output it without having to do in points and out points and in points and out points. And, and uh, there's a very simple, simple way in DaVinci Resolve. And that's why this video is only going to take a couple of minutes. So I have these different pieces that I want to upload as stock footage. I'm going to go to my deliver tab. And let's see, I'm going to close some of this and open this up. See if we can get as much of this over here on this side as possible. So where do I want to output it? I'm going to output it to this stock folder. I'm going to give it a name and this is going to be uh, Denver Stock 11 for November. And here under render, by default, it says single clip. Well, there's an option for individual clips. So I'm going to select that. And I'm going to go to the file tab here. Now we don't need audio. So you don't even need to export audio for if you're doing stock footage. So I'm going to go over to file and make sure I have custom name. I got my custom name here. I'm going to use unique file names. Otherwise it's just going to overwrite the same one. And I usually do suffix and I don't need to add the frame count. And that's going to be my magic combination. So individual clips, custom name, the name of the batch that I'm doing so I can keep them organized once I upload them. Click on unique file names. I don't need a suffix and uh, uh, the um, suffix selected here. I'm going to add this to my render queue and start render. Let's go and look at my stock folder and I have my stock footage folder and here I have a group of M or group of clips that I've done that are ready to be uploaded. So very simple way of batching out a bunch of exports with DaVinci Resolve. Now personally, I use blackbox.global. The advantage is I can upload them in one place do all my metadata and my the curation needed, or I can have someone else do it. I can have someone else help me with it. Or if I've shot with someone else, we can split the revenue. So that's some cool stuff about Blackbox. But I upload it to Blackbox, and people don't buy the footage from Blackbox. What Blackbox does is they push it out to Pond5, Shutterstock, uh, Adobe Stock, and one other, uh, I can't remember. And they're looking to adding more agencies down the road. So all I have to do is put it in one place. It goes to all the major uh, stock footage agencies and I sit back and collect money. So if you would like to be, uh, like to try out Black Box, I have a referral link down in the description. It's a trivial amount. I only get like a 1%, you know, of sales that has, doesn't impact the money that you make at all. So it's kind of a, a good deal for both of us. Help support the channel here. So uh, try out Blackbox if you want a place to upload your footage. So this is a quick video on how to export your, your footage for stock and uh, where to put it, I suppose. So thanks for watching. Be sure and subscribe. Click the bell icon if you would like to be notified every time a new video comes out. So you can also always get quickies like this when I just decide to throw something up. Plus our regular Movie Making Monday and Fusion or Fairlight Fridays. So thanks for watching everybody. I will catch you next time. Bye-bye.